Hi, it's Kirsten with fab.embroidery.com and a Christmas tree skirt project for you. I used photo fabric to make this tree skirt and I used family photos to make it personal. I used for this project a poly French terry fabric which turns out to be smooth on the top, a little bit of stretch to it, and on the underside it's like a terry cloth, just a, a really small terry. So I began by figuring out that I could do 48 inches of um, 48 inches of original design. So I made a 48 inch square on my screen, and then I used the fo the tools on board there at fab.embroidery.com to add a circle and a concentric circle inside of it to make the the like donut shape of my tree skirt. And I colored the, the donut blue because that's the tree skirt color I wanted. And then I added snowflakes and some dove elements from the clip art that you can find at fab.embroidery.com. Then I started to add my family photos. I added some old archival photos for my family. And then I also added some new ones in the outer ring of the, of the tree skirt. So that I have a little of both. So I chose to print this on a yard, on two yards of fabric. So I got a tree skirt and a half actually when it was printed. And I used the Poly French Terry. It turned out really nice, I thought. And when it arrived, it was easy for me to just cut away the white areas that I had planned and do a hem on the inside and outside and cut a slit for the tree to go in. And then my tree skirt was finished. If you'd like more directions and more specific details about this project, you can go to embroidery.com, find my photo fabric blog, and it'll be there for you. I also would like to thank you for watching and um, direct you to make sure your notifications are turned on so you know when a new video is up. I'll see you next time on fab.embroidery.com.